Hola brochachos. So, um, I just wanted to ask a little question here before we get the escape vlog started. Um, this weekend I was recently able to post or purchase a gaming PC. Now, that being said, um, I'm trying to figure out if anybody or any of my subscribers currently would be interested in me posting some gaming content. Um, that would be like Call of Duty, Forza, um, things of that nature. Um, maybe even start streaming on Twitch um, if that would be better for y'all. Um, please leave a like and a comment if you would like me to start posting this sort of content. If not, uh, just let me know. Simple as that. Alright, let's get to the vlog. Alright, what is going on guys? So, uh, today we're going to do another escape vlog. Um, my past two ones actually got a pretty good response from everybody. Uh, got a good amount of views in, in the first or second days that they were up. So, I think I'm going to continue this and make a whole series out of them, the, the escape vlog series. Um, but... Right now, I am sitting in traffic trying to get out of my university. I just got out of sociology and I am dead. It's an hour and 15 minute class. And there's so much traffic getting out of this dang garage. So, I'm kind of stuck, sadly. Um, but, this weekend, I did a lot of stuff. Um, my girlfriend came up for the weekend and we celebrated Valentine's Day since uh, her and I are long distance and she lives out in Bridgewater Virginia and I live here in Morgantown so it's hard for us to um, kind of see each other a lot so we decided hey we we're gonna meet up that weekend to go on our date and just have a good time for the weekend um, so I did a lot of or I, I hung out with her a lot and um, I didn't really have too much time to film or anything like that I did put out two videos over the weekend I know that it's not part of my schedule, but um, I had time to finally edit some videos that I've been building up. Um, so I edited those, posted them on Saturday and Sunday. Oh man, there's a Mustang coming up and it is so nice. Oh man. Oh, speed bumps just blocking it. Is it boosted? I think I see an inner cooler on it. Never mind. Oh man, he had it lowered and everything. It looked nice. Just don't have the right engine in there. Um, but yeah, this weekend I really didn't do that much. Um, just hung out with her and hung out with some friends. Uh, went to go see a movie, stuff like that. I was gonna do a uh, a video titled like five things my girlfriend hates about my car. Um, I thought about doing that, but again, time just kind of ran away from us. Um, so I didn't have a chance to, but I will be going back to Virginia next weekend or this weekend um, in order to grab the rest of my stuff from my house back in Virginia and bring it up here or sell it or do whatever I need to do with it. Um, so that being said, I probably will try to do that video next weekend and put that out for you all on like next Monday or Tuesday or Monday or Wednesday. Um, so yeah, there's that. Uh, what else is there? Um, I had originally thought about going to Motorama in Pennsylvania from like where Street Speed 717 and Guitar Mageddon ZL1 are going to be doing their like little appearance of the show. Um, I thought about going there, but again, stuff came up and honest, I'm not going to be able to anymore um, unless I go like Sunday during the day. Um, but sadly, I will not be making that. Gosh, this one guy will not pull out into... Ugh. I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I have ten cars ahead of me trying to pull out on this one street. To go on the freaking PA system, pull up the siren, and be like, ah, get out of my way. Man, it's hard to think when you're just sitting in one spot waiting for traffic to go. Also, there's a Jeep Grand Cherokee in front of me that has like street tires, but like there's so much offset on them that they're poking out. I mean, that would be cool if you had off-road tires or maybe a lift or something like that, but they're just street tires. They, they're almost bold street tires. <laughs> Why would you do that? Um, and then I got a uh, Chevy or GMC truck behind me that's probably souped up. Got a lot of students here in West Virginia um, from like Dubai and all the Middle Eastern countries that got shitloads of money. 
So we usually have a lot of people with a lot of money around here. Um, like, I did a video a while back about this one guy with a uh, Procharge GMC um, Sierra or something like that. Yeah, that guy, he's, um, I think he's from Dubai. Um, I'm pretty sure the guy behind me is also from Dubai. Um, I got a lot of people in my apartment complex from there as well who drive like brand new Mustangs, brand new Corvettes. It's really annoying, but also kind of cool. For some odd reason, they always go park it or like go out driving at 3 or 4 o'clock in the morning. Like on weekdays. Let's go, let's go start up the Corvette for no obvious reason and just do that at 3 in the morning because uh, uh, fuck everybody else, right? Yeah, that makes sense. Alright, I'm going. Don't make me get on the PA system. I'll do it. Yeah, this Jeep looks so freaking obnoxious and stupid. apply for a few jobs around here in order to um, kind of save up some more money, some more money, get me some more spending money. Um, recently, it's, it's been a little hectic with money. Um, my roommates and I and my girlfriend are all planning a trip out to... Um, Stay in your lane, bud. Um, planning a trip over the summer and we kind of went over finances and everything like that and it's gonna be a little bit well, it's not a little bit it's gonna be a lot of money so i need to start saving up for that i have all the money on hand but it's a lot of it going towards my savings what i thought would be my mustang fund so i need a i need another source of income here so i can save up and do all these fun things over the summer um another thing is um I'm not even sure if it's going to be legit or organized or anything like that, but one on one of our uh, uh, escape forums or escape pages on Facebook, um, I had one guy come up with a suggestion of going out to the Outer Banks, and there's a four-wheel drive island out there where they only allow four-wheel drive vehicles out there, and um, you can either just go around trails, you can go camping, it's, it's right on the beach. Like, the whole island is on the beach. I mean, it's an island. But um, we are talking about setting up a big escape meet or camping weekend or whatever the heck it is for other escape owners with four wheel drives to come out there and um, just kind of enjoy the weekend. I mean, what's better than off-roading and camping? I mean, I can't really think of a lot. So that might be happening. Um, if you, I, I don't know. I think we said maybe late spring earlier late summer I think um, so if the dates line up I'm definitely gonna do that there will be a lot of prep videos for the escape for that to get a whole bunch of camping gear overlanding gear all that fun stuff um, I have to figure out how I can keep my batteries charged for the two days that I'm out there so I can film for y'all or just buy new batteries because um, I definitely want to document that if, we, if we're gonna do that that'll be so much fun and I, I'm really looking forward to meeting a lot of these people. Um, one, one awesome, here I'll kind of cut this a little bit right here and do another video about this topic of the escape community. So, um, yeah, if, if I cut it off here, I cut it off here. Peace out, subscribe, like the video, uh, comment. But if I don't, then I'm keeping on going. Yeah, I think that, that trip could be a lot of fun. I'm really hoping we can all organize it and go out there and meet. Because honestly, through the escape community, I've met a lot of awesome people and um, got to experience a lot of different ideas that I never really thought I would. Um, kind of with this car and just things you can do to it and different styles people do to these. Um, one guy I know has this thing on bags, one guy has it completely slammed and then static. Um, it's cool stuff that you can do with these cars in the community for, but it's just amazing. Oh man. It's a red light. But anyways, I'm going to uh, cut the video here. Um, I'll talk to y'all later. Like, comment, and subscribe on my videos. And um, I'll see you when I see you.
Peace out.